Hello, welcome or welcome back. It's your woman Angela K O D. Today we are making wachi awamu with my special red pepper sauce. This video is in collaboration with Angie Delicious Kitchen. Please check on her channel and subscribe to her channel. Also support her. I'm going to leave all the details in the description box. Come with me and let's cook this delicious healthy meal. But if you're new to this channel, guys, subscribe and be part of this great family. And for my subscribers, Team Angela KOD and everyone watching my videos, thank you so much for your love and support. I really appreciate you guys always coming along. Thank you so much. Come with me. By the way, hit the notification bell, like my video, share this video with your friends and family. Come with me and let's cook this delicious, healthy meal. Come. For ingredients for making our wachi and we will be needing our rice. This is our cooked and black eyed beans. We need our rosemary, stocky powder, stocky curry powder, peppers. We have our habanero pepper and some green peppers. We have our garlic and ginger. This is our curry paste. This is our dawa dawa. We need in our red bell pepper and we're also using the seed from the red pepper for more flavors. We have some eggs to go with, vegetable oil coconut oil and some onions shallots and red onions so these are the ingredients we'll be needing for our cooking and i forgot we are going to accompany this delicious meal with some siding so the siding will come later we'll go ahead and start with our pepper sauce i'm going to chop all the ingredients in. i'm going to use my hand blender because i don't want the sauce to be really salt Let's go ahead and start with our pepper sauce. This particular sauce is very special because it can be eaten with any things just say egg dan kasa. And now we so this is vegan. and I'm really I'm not going to add any meat to it or any fish. It's a hundred percent vegetarian. So I go ahead and add my chopped onion. As you know, I always add everything direct because I don't want to heat destroys the nutritional value of my oil so everything goes in direct we'll go ahead and blend our bell peppers we are catching our bell peppers for blending our onions are well done just the way we want it to go ahead and Add our blended peppers and ginger and garlic and the seed from the from the bell pepper. As we go in this pepper, it's really um, Jamie this here and lots and lots of onions we need for this particular sauce. Let's go ahead and mix everything in and I'm going to add a teaspoon of salt. Salt in everything is always to your taste but I do really like a lot of salt in my dishes so for me all salt is always to my taste. I'm going to go ahead and add a teaspoon of salt. Our dawa dawa, that is the almighty dawa dawa or look at this. I'll go ahead and add my curry paste. curry powder as well and we'll go ahead and add my stock powder stock powder and I'll stir everything in we need all these flavors in this sauce so we we'll are not be a meat we are not going to add any powdered fish or shrimp so the dawa dawa and the curry powder and all these heads are going to do the job and brings out all the flavors that we need for this sauce. I have a video. This is a red pepper sauce. 
but I have a video of the yellow pepper sauce with my designer Awamu. You can check out the video on the channel. It was also a hit. We'll go ahead and add our rosemary to the bell pepper for blending. We'll go ahead and add our blended red bell pepper to the sauce. This particular sauce is like shito, but this one we don't add any fish powder to it and it's, we don't make it like really black. So this is like pepper sauce, it's like shito, or we call, I call it real bell, real bell pepper sauce. You can also put, you can put it in the fridge and eat it and use it anytime you want. And it has to be in the fridge, not like shito, you can just leave it on, a, on your counter. I'll go ahead and add my one stock key. This is vegetable stock key. So this sauce is also for vegan vegetarians. We'll go ahead and chop our onions for the wachi and almond. So the shallots really into little pieces because we really want it. In smaller pieces, it's very important because we are going to shred the white ones. So the red onion and the shallots will chop them into smaller pieces. Let's go ahead and start with our wache and wabu. So we can use coconut oil. But if you don't have coconut oil, you can use any oil of your choice. I'll add my chopped shredded bread in one shallot. I want to make it really much. Let's see how far I'm going and the combination of the oil to the coconut oil makes your value to the next level. Test it for another level. Nothing is worth in this kitchen. Can you see what I'm doing? <laughs> For dinner, you didn't hear a warm wood. It really has to be cooked and said, Bring, send a bear when your flavor is really very good. So, it's very important anytime you are frying your or onions for your oil rice or a warm it really needs to be cooked. It really, really is very important. So, I'll go so that you get all the flavors that you need because it brings out a lot of flavors in your warm I'll go ahead and add my rice. Let's go ahead and add our water from the kettle to our rice. Right. The water is okay. okay. Now go ahead and add sauce. I added salt to my beans when cooking it. That's why I add only a teaspoon of salt to this egg. Right, so I'll go ahead and add my beans and I'll stir everything in. This is what she allowed So the the portion of rice to your beans depends on how you want to you know, watch it to be. So I'll add a little more water. And I'll stir everything in. 
and taste for salt. Salt is always to your taste. So I'll add one more teaspoon of salt. So I'll be able to add one more teaspoon of salt. So I'll be able to add one So stir everything in. And I'll cover it up. For me to start well. As soon as it boils over, I'll just know what the heck. Because if I say, yeah, I'm going to sit there. I'll sit there. Let's cover it. When the high heat and they will come back and the white are fine to spoil. Let's check on our sauce and see how it's doing. Guys, just have a look. Our sauce is doing perfect. To say. Sauce we pay it watch it and one more so I know go fish we should not be do them call and yeah some kids all and yeah as some kids so so just, 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 just have a look, guys. Because I can't wait to dig in this sauce with my watchy and one more to ensure. It's doing really perfect. I see and she will just have a look. It's not bad. On the medium heat, I say the image of the paper. The flavors here are heavenly. So just cover it up. We really need to get rid of a lot of water from this sauce. And watch, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. It's a kosher fridge, man. Then we can eat it little by little. Amen. Our rice is doing perfect. So we'll go ahead and lower the heat to the lowest, and then the the vapor is going to do its job. Let's check on our rice. See how it's doing. Just guys, have a look. Our rice is doing perfect. It's almost ready, so I'm going to cover it for more five minutes and then we'll take it and serve. Our rice is okay, so we are going to set our rice aside and fry our eggs. Let's fry our eggs. Let's mix in our sauce. Chibon. Oh. Our sauce is ready, so I'm going to put on the fire. Let's dig in and serve. Guys, just have a look. You watch it. I want my papa be now. You ready? Wahano. Just look at this goodies. Yeah. Just have a look, guys. Just uh, add our side in. Oh, and yes, some kids. Uh, Just have a look. You do any papa be nae day. I shall read you a hano. I will watch it and one more papa be. In the very healthy and also nutritious. Thank you so, so, so much for coming with me to make this delicious healthy meal. As I said earlier on, this video is in collaboration with angie's delicious kitchen please check out on my sister and subscribe to her channel support and give her show her a lot of love as she'll be doing for me thank you thank you so much for coming with me to make this delicious healthy meal by for new to this channel guys what are you waiting for 
please 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 subscribe and be part of this great family and for my subscribers and everyone watching my videos thank you so much for your love and support i really appreciate you guys always coming along thank you thank you thank you i will see you in my next video hit the notification bell give me a thumbs up share this video with your friends and family thank you i'll see you in my next video bye bye do adios bye